Make sure Frank gets a seat. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I know so many people in this audience. <laughs> yeah. Not like I papered the house or anything, but I do really do know I know a lot of you personally. <laughs> This, is, this song was written because somebody invited me to, to get on a train that was going from New York to Albany, oh, no, Oakland. And it was gonna, every place it stopped, they would get out and have an art happening. There was a young guy, an artist, I know a name, Doug Aiken. I, I tried to tell him I knew what a happening was. Yeah. But eventually, I, and they wanted to, they wanted, like, they wanted everybody to get off the train and make this thing happen, and, and but they said, but it's not a concert, so, you know. I thought, well, but you want us to make music? I said, yeah, but it's not a concert. Because you need to have equipment to make music, and I could tell that they weren't, you know, allocating a whole lot of the train to gear, you know. It was just going to be like one car with a couple musicians in there, you know, doing really cinematic, cinema, Cinematic stuff, like play the piano in the train and stuff like that. I'm fascinating, huh? So, <laughs> anyway, I told him, I, I, what I'll do is I'll just show up in one of the cities along the way and we'll just like bring enough gear in a, in a truck, you know, to do, do the concert. I mean, the hard happening. So, uh, that's what we did. And the talent shows, I could choose between Lawrence, Kansas, and Chicago, and Barstow. <laughs> no, why is that funny? There is an actual, uh, an, on the internet, there's a heading, like it's a thing you can Google. You, know, you can do it like, you know, seven things to do in Barstow. <laughs> or maybe just five, I maybe mean, made up the other two. <laughs> anyway, I decided to do it in Winslow, Arizona. And uh, I wrote this song as my sort of site-specific art song. It's just a country song, but I get to call it that because it's you know, part of this. Anyway, uh, this is about one of the old timers that used to come off the train where I lived in Los Angeles. When the train would slow down to cross Figueroa Street, all these great old hobos would jump off the train. What is it? Figueroa Street, they did the same thing in, in Paso Robles. Are there a lot of fugitives or a lot of refugees from LA up here? <laughs> I would do the same thing if somebody mentioned Figueroa, you know, in, 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 I mean, I would do it inwardly. I wouldn't necessarily give up that I was from L.A., but that's your choice. <laughs> anyway, this is called Leaving Winslow.
the tank of oxygen. Old ladies kept him going. He'd recite for them his favorite coin. He specialized in western swing and sand. Station to station, coast to coast. Not that much of anything, mine. No expectation. We're in the simple. Long as I got oxygen and wine. I keep on hearing about the discipline that goes on my head. And I keep on hearing about the discipline that eating that shell. And I keep on hearing about the discipline of the middle class. But I figure out they're doing some disappearing.